let's let's record this here okay all right so you've got you've got two closes going on here okay so what you're talking about is closing at the end i think i've said everything needs to be said i think they have an understanding of what they're doing i think uh i i believe they are ready to actually make the decision i think they're ready to make the decision and then you close right so the one thing that a lot of people don't think about in sales and don't know about in sales is that the closing process begins at the beginning you're you open with closing right so you were like where are you at now where do you want to be where are you going so the recipe for me is step one two three right where are you at now where do you want to be how are you going to get there and then when we discuss we're discussing that how are you going to get there uh, you've got some closing questions you can do in that interim right so so as you're going through the process um let's line out a couple of these okay i wish i had my whiteboard uh so simple one does that work for you does that make sense would you do that would that work for you okay you can even start asking things like uh is there anything i'm missing <clears throat> right so as you're going through the process of working them through that recipe that i've i've showed you before you got where are you at now where are you going and then how are you going to get there and the process is you want to get buy-in along the way, right? Because number one, I want to make sure they're with me. Are you with me? You know are what you, that reminds are you, me are of? Are you with me? <laughs> yeah, I am. It just clicked, it clicked with me. We're uh, doing some word problems. Kind of like all the, like, you know, when you do a word math problem, there's key words in there that trigger, boom. Bingo. That's addition or right. subtraction. These words are like completion. Yeah, I'm good. Yes. Kind of okay, triggers so, it. No, so okay. you said... You wanted to, you told me X is where you're at. You told me Y is where you are. We discussed this getting you there. Will that work for you? Okay. If so I you said to me, you, you wanted to have more closings. Okay. I just showed you three ways you can have more closings. Are you willing to do that stuff? Does that stuff make sense? Are you willing to do that? Would that work for you? Do you think that would get you where you want to go? And they're going to be like, yes, 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 yes. Okay. The yeses. Is there anything you'd like to change in that? No. See, it's easier for, pe for people to say no than yes. Although you want to get them into what we would consider a yes state of mind. So yeah. uh, like you'll see Tony Robbins do this. Like, do you want to live a better life? Yes. Do you want to be healthy? Yes. Do you want to be tall? Yes. Do you want to be stronger? Yes. Do you want to be more? Yes. And then he's like, okay, here we go. Yes. Yes. <laughs> He does that and he said, get you into a yes state of mind. You can't do that when you're doing sales because it freaks people all the way out, obviously. But yeah. you can subtly go through this and say, will that work for you? Yeah, good. So will that's something you could do. Yes, because sometimes I propose something. I say, is that something you would do? And they're like, you know, I'm really not that kind of per. You know, I really just don't want to do video. Okay, great. So if you're not willing to do that, what are you willing to do? And they say, okay, so so you're willing to do that. Yes. Okay, so here's you. Here's where you are now. Here's where you where you're going to be. Where you want to be. We just showed you three ways to get there. You said you'd be willing to do that. Sounds like a plan you'd actually enjoy. What are, what else are we missing at this point? Is there anything else missing at this point for you to make a good decision? Sounds like to me this is a solution. Just ask them, right? It's like doing a listing appointment. So you go into a listing appointment. I go through the information. Okay, uh, so here's my whole listing presentation. Ready? It's almost identical to the recruiting thing, right? Okay, so today there's a couple of things we want to talk about. I've done this a couple hundred times with people selling houses, and I found that there's three things really important. Number one, what is the price that your house is worth? Everybody wants to know that, right? And yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, good. Number two is how much is it going to cost for you to sell your house so you know how much money you net? You want to know that too. And they're like, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, and then my third question is, is there a uh, third thing is, Typically, people want to know, am I the right guy for the job of selling your house? Okay. By the time we get through number one and number two, you're already going to know the answer to number three. So I'm not going to spend a bunch of time talking about myself unless there's something specific you want to know. Does that sound fair? Yeah, great. So now let me ask you a question. Is there anything else that's important to you that you want to talk about today? And they'll say something like occasionally, they'll say, well, you know, I want to, I want to talk about your commission. Fantastic. Absolutely. We're going to cover that in number two. Man, typically they're like, Jackson, I've said done this so many times. They're like, no, that's pretty much all we want to know. 
Like, well, good. That's why I only did. Like, I don't want to sit here for two hours giving you a lecture of how great I am and show you a binder with 20 things. There are people that do that. That's just not the way I do it. Most of the time, by the way, I'm also referred to them. Most of the time, somebody's already said Russ is the guy, right? So back when I was right. doing, I'm not showing up with random people that have no clue who I am. Typically, hey, you were referred to me for a reason. We get the job done and we communicate well. I don't want you to ever go to sleep at night wondering what the heck are we doing? What's the next step? Okay. So I consider it a failure if you wonder where we're at at any point. Okay. So every night when you go to bed, I want you to know, here's where we're at. Here's when the next step is. And here's when I expect to hear from Russ next. Does that sound fair? Good. But here's, here's why I say that Jackson, because every single person in the industry will, or that's, that's working with our industry will say uh, the number one thing lacking in real estate is communication. By the way, that's the number one thing lacking in a bunch of businesses, but communication is horrible. When we have complaints, it's communication. They didn't over-communicate. They under-communicate a lot. So I make up for a lot of people. I talk. <laughs> <laughs> Good, right? So so, so now we've just got to make it effective, right? Ooh. So talk without being effective is just blabber, right? You don't want to just create noise. We want to create a result. So why are we having the conversation? You're here now. You want to be here. Let me show you a couple of ways to get there. Does that make sense? Yes. Now I've got buy-in and I'm getting buy-in the whole time. First thing, you wanted a couple of different things to get more business to come to you, right? So uh, let me show you three things that we have that do lead generation at eXp that cost you nothing. Just a little bit of time, okay? Would you do that? Yes. Would you use that? Yes. Is that something that you'd probably do well with? Yes. If I gave you that, do you think you could close stuff with that? And a lot of times the answer will be yes. Okay, good. So now I solved their couple problems. Okay, so I've just showed you from point A to point B. Here's the three things you can do to get from point A to point B. Are you willing to do that for the next 12 months consistently to get success? And if they say yes, great. So what do you think the next step is? Ask Are you them. ready to join? No, no, no. I'm going to ask them, what do you think the next step is? Sounds oh. like to me, we've got the recipe to help you get from point A to point B. So what do you think the next step is for you? Okay, and they can say any number of things. If you've gone through this stuff and, and walked them through that recipe, chances are they're gonna be like, you know what? Yes, this makes sense. Great. So what we said makes sense. You're willing to do it. You think this will help solve the problem and you've got a tour guide to help you through that process, which is me. So what would stop you from making the decision to jump in now? Nothing. Easier to say no than yes. Nothing. Okay, great. So are you, you ready to talk about next steps? Yes. Yeah. What's the next step? What's the next step? So you ready to talk about the next step? Boom. Next step. Let's let's jump on the join system. So all we have to do now is just do the join jump in the join app. We could do that online. You could do it on your phone and start the process, depending on what state you're in. Uh, it could take you know between 24 and 48 hours to make the process move through. If we get stuck at any point, we've got an onboarding specialist that is at your beck and call. There's an 800 number you can call if you ever get stuck on anything. So we can move the ball forward. So here's 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 what we'll do. Let's let's do first step first right now. You ready? Okay. And then you can pop them in a join. Make sure they select you as sponsor, of course. Okay, because that gets missed sometimes. Because <laughs> they're like, I didn't know what to do, so I just put in nobody. And then they're <laughs> okay. So uh -oh. even though you tell them when they're doing it, now it occurs to them because the sponsors, you got to keep in mind, they don't know the language we're speaking. I don't like, they don't know sponsors. Sponsors a weird word in the real estate business. They don't understand how the EXP system works. I don't want to assume anything. So here's how this works, by the way. And then you can walk them through how that, how that works. So the, the point of the process really is you're starting the process. If you're following the recipe, where are you at now? Where are you going? How are you going to get there? And are you willing, for, would you like me to make a couple of suggestions to show you how to get from point A to point B? Yes. Perfect. Let's look at boom, boom, boom. Solve their problems. 